you very much for joining us here at the Geneva Center for Security Policy. Yes, it's a pleasure. And uh, could you please introduce uh, your name, your role, and where you are from? I'm uh, Major General Noel Clement. I'm currently in command of an infantry division based uh, down south in the uh, Philippines. And uh, I have been serving the Armed Forces of the Philippines for more than 30 years already. And you're here at the Geneva Center for yes. Security Policy, partaking in the annual Senior Officers Seminar. Yes. Um, what have you guys been discussing there? My first perception was that I would be able to, to learn a lot about European affairs and uh, on how um, Europe and NATO addresses their the security challenges. For the past uh, three days, um, the lectures that have been given to us and as well as my discussions with the other participants have given me a better perspective of uh, how NATO and Europe works uh, in addressing these challenges. And uh, I think it can help me a lot in uh, my future military career and uh, give me a better perspective of uh, not only the region where, where we come from, but of course the other regions uh, within the world. And how is it to interact with high-level officials from across the world, many yeah. different backgrounds, many different countries? Well, if we look at the current uh, security challenges that our nations uh, confront, a lot of them are affecting not only a specific country, but uh, rather almost all of us, especially uh, when we talk about terrorism, climate change um, and other um, common security challenges. So it's very important that uh, we always uh, discuss, um, share um, common stories or share uh, common ideas so that when we address these challenges, it gives us a better perspective on uh, how we can really solve these problems. And it's very important that we, we share a lot of uh, the experiences that we have been through, especially when we talk about uh, information sharing on terrorism. What happens probably in the Philippines, if I share this with the other countries, um, they could better prevent um, some of the issues that are happening in our country from also happening within their respective uh, territories. So it's very important that we share all of this information so that we can help uh, make uh, our countries better places to live in. These forums uh, that, we, that we attended uh, for the past few days have helped a lot in opening uh, up uh, a lot of issues. With my discussions with uh, the other members of the, of the class, I've, I've heard, learned a lot about uh, how they, they address the, the challenges, that, uh, the security challenges that they have been confronting. And hopefully I could um, relate all of these um, um, strategies and uh, probably influence uh, our government to, to be able to adopt some of these and uh, better address the issues that we are currently confronting. Thank you. And, and my final question to you, yeah. if I may. Yeah. What does a day in the life of a, someone in your position, what does that look like? We are currently confronting um, local uh, insurgencies. So that takes up a lot of our time actually. And um, we need to make sure that we address these uh, uh, challenges internally so that we can actually develop as a nation. Right now, um, the, our president, uh, President Duterte, has desired that uh, we need to finish this challenge internally so that we can really move on as a nation. Well, um, it takes up a lot of my time actually as a commander um, to address all of these issues, but more importantly, we still continue to discuss policies and strategies that will actually help improve the lives of the Filipino people. And all of these uh, security challenges, once addressed, will actually lead towards that uh, objective.